Being attracted to the opposite sex comes with different form and different method. Hi guys, welcome back to another episode of Moments with Nikki. Hope you enjoyed my previous video. How are you guys doing? Now tell me, how are you doing? Hope you guys are keeping safe. Always remember to use your face mask and use your hand sanitizer. So guys, today I'm back again with another interesting you know you know how we do it interesting yeah. episode my name still remains adenike and welcome back to my channel today i'll be talking about love triangle have you ever been in a love triangle before have you ever been attracted to someone that doesn't even like you have you ever been in a messy triangle with someone like the person likes you but has feeling for someone else a very complicated relationship have you ever been in that kind of situation take your time and watch this video and i'll be telling you the main meaning of love triangle and how to get yourself out of that mess. Let's go. <laughs> so love triangle simply means when you are in a messy or a very, very complicated relationship with someone. It might not even be a relationship. It might be a situation whereby you are attracted to someone that doesn't have feelings for you. It happens very well or in your mind you in short some people in their mind they already they have already gotten married to a lot of superstars hollywood stars and everything so it comes in love triangle comes in different way and different methods but the most obvious one is the most obvious one is when you imagine that you're in love with someone you've never met i call that infatuation that one is very very bad and a lot of us kind of like do it especially when you watch a certain movie and you just watch love the actor and you start stalking the actor i'm like oh my god this is my older this is my wife it happens but the one that is more risky is when you get attracted to someone that is closer to you maybe like a friend you get attracted to a friend and you know very well that this guy does not like you mm -hmm. you know very well that this girl does not like you but you're you're in your mind you guys are in love so it's kind of really, really, it's very, very messy. It's very, very messy. When it comes to relationship issue, yeah, guys have certain things that they are attracted to. Why right? girls have certain things that are, that they are attracted to. As a guy, most guys get attracted to girls because of their look. Mm -hmm. Most girls, most guys get attracted to girls because of the way they walk. I know of a guy that told me, Nikki, I like the way this girl walks, like the way she walks, the way she carries herself like a queen. I really love that. That's that's why I'm super attracted to her. So a lot of guys get attracted to girls because of the way they smell or the how intelligent they are or how beautiful they are look appearance. So it all comes in it all comes in different ways. Why some guys get attracted to girls because of their accents, because of their work ethnic, because of the way they carry themselves, because of the way they smell. The thing is being attracted to the opposite sex comes in different form and different methods. In your mind, you might feel, oh, I'm pretty, I'm all that, and nobody can resist me. This guy is going to turn you down because everybody have what they like. You can't, you can't make someone like you because you have it all. That might not, the person might not really want you for that. You get, everybody have what they like and what they don't Being like. in a love triangle in a relationship can be so messy. I have a friend that was in that kind of situation before. When she started this, dating this guy, like, they were in love. They were all over each other. Like, the love was there and everything. But suddenly, the guy started losing feeling because of some certain things the girl started doing. And that's when it comes, when it comes to relationship, like, no matter how, how in love you are with this person, you can actually fall out of love with that particular person. So it's very possible for you to fall out of love with that person. So the thing is, um, the guy started having feeling for someone else. And the guy told the girl, see, I have feeling for this person. We need to end the relationship. But the girl said, mm -mm, umba, no, I love you. I die here. I'm going to be here. So it was kind of messy. It was a really, really messy situation for her. And I had to advise her. I told her, see, babes, like this is what you have to do you just need to let this guy go because obviously you know that he's in love with someone else she was like no nikki i'm gonna make him come back you can't guys they know what they want once a guy is after you he's after you once he tells you he's over it is over my girl let him go you are a queen you're pre you're so beautiful like you're gonna see someone else that's gonna treat you and adore you like that's gonna be all over you that is the kind of love we want not the one that will be begging ah stop calling this girl stop don't put me in a messy triangle it's gonna piss me off don't put me in a messy triangle don't put me in a messy situation what's that 
No, tell me why. So it's just lack of crazy. honesty in a relationship can actually put someone in a love triangle because your partner doesn't trust you. He believes that, oh, this person you're talking to, you have something with the person. So that, that kind of thinking can actually bring a lot of negative thoughts and it, it might start losing interest. So it is really, really kind of messy. Like a lot of people are actually in a love triangle in a relationship, but they don't know how to figure it out. They don't know how to solve the situation. They don't know how to solve the equation. It is simple. Talk to your partner. Have a, have, a, have a nice conversation with your partner. Tell them, oh, this is it. This is it. How can we solve it? How can we fix this? I don't want to be in a messy relationship. I want, I want to have you all to myself. I don't want to situation you by, oh, you're hanging out to this person because mm -mm. if you don't want to be with me, be with me. If you don't want to be with me, let's break up. See, is breaking up is not a crime breaking up is not the end of the world it hurts trust me the first one month is gonna be ill like you won't be able to do anything but after that you're gonna heal you're gonna feel much better so one thing i just want you to know is treat yourself like a queen and like a king that you are and never settle for less never be a second option to anybody because you are beautiful you are amazing you're the best in whatever you do if this is your first time coming to my youtube channel i beg you please subscribe to this channel so you can get notified when next i post a next video i still remain your girl at any care and don't forget to follow me on my instagram page yes 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 i post one thing a lot of people don't know is i post i'm more active on instagram compared to youtube so you want to see more of me follow me on my instagram <laughs> And I'll see you on the next episode of Moments with Nikki. Bye.